Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I will be showing you guys my Animal Crossing Island. I have been getting numerous uh, requests to show it off. So this is my little character. I do like her. She fits in right with everyone. Um, please note that I do time travel. That's why I'm on the 7th of October. And um, I am in the Southern Hemisphere though. And what else? Uh, my island is definitely still a work in progress. So let's go through so that I can show you guys my entrances. Um, and let's get exploring. So there are some stuff that's still lying around. Like for example this. So basically this is how my entrance looks. Got these flowers and everything and the little bench where you can relax and look at the flowers. We got the little wheelbarrow here as well as these tall lanterns. Uh, I'll also cut to a scene where you can see how this looks at night. So again another little chair here. If you want to build something you can do that and basically this is how the entrance would look like so yes let's greet everyone so as you can see this thing says welcome and this shows you guys where my shop is so let's go to the shop I'll introduce all my villagers in a second so this is the beachfront though uh, let's get to the beachfront in first these are the um, little beds you can sleep on during your uh, stay or maybe get a tan and then these are the beach items and stuff let me just get through it's a bit busy but still a work in progress um, so yeah it looks like you could really have a great time here maybe take a tan and sleep here for a bit then always a lifeguard here and obviously play with your beach balls um, bounce that surfboards nice little hot tubs a nice ham hammock I think that's what it's called sleep here so that only goes for a bit um, not going too far up and um, also there's a little um, what do you call it turtle uh, trying to get to the ocean hopefully so then uh, let's go back uh, I don't want to reveal everything just yet um, well and here's another one see they're walking so this is a nice little area I'm still not completely finished this will be like your kids play area let me get those weeds and a small little get together area so then you go up here this is where my shopping district is so these are the uh, items that you can buy at um, the able sisters except for one of these but uh, this is how they um, show off their designs we've got a small cafe here so if you want to um, take a minute get something to drink here are your baristas so then they and this is basically just the shop um, I'm not going in there just yet um, so then if you go down here or up there you can see some bunnies this is a little area where you can swim and relax but then it's time to get changed okay I don't really have a winter um, outfit so this is the winter wonderland area so guys you should be able to by now figure out what's the theme of my island it is four seasons so this is winter wonderland so let's say hi to bob the snowman let's say greetings and i've decided to make it as if i'm in the northern hemisphere where it's winter during uh, Christmas but usually it is summer when it is winter time here so let's go up um, so this isn't really done really um, my rock garden is up here at still a work in progress then um, here's one of the villagers areas so this house belongs to Pietro 
It is a clown goat, I believe. And this is Dom. He is a jock type villager. Also a, a goat or sheep or a ram or whatever you want to call it. It does look like he is home, so let's go visit him and say hello. Maybe he has something he's going to craft, so we do not know. Oh, look, he's crafting. So let's see what he is crafting. Hey Dom, hey Roxy, perfect timing. Come take a look in the jewelry do. Um, you're not going to believe it, I'm making a stack of wood wall. Hmm, don't know if I do have this. <laughs> so he be very shy. Uh, sure, teach me. Oh no wait, I don't have it. So let's learn this little recipe though. But I do like his home. It's nice. Uh, let's do this. Let's learn this thingy. Sweet. Okay, so on to the next one. Uh, I do believe Pietro is not home at the moment. He might be wandering off somewhere in um, the island. So still just there's not really anything good. Um, and let's go to this side. I'll come to my um, campsite after we did the tour and look I've got my guardian monster here it's Godzilla of course so this is basically just the woody area for Christmas and here's your present okay so basically that is that for winter so let's go to the other side of the island where we will be seeing spring although that area isn't fully uh, done yet because I still need a lot of items so we just entered the spring area um, so I'll show you guys the museum in a moment so this B Julian he is a horse but technically is a um, unicorn so he's awesome and here we do have Judy okay so she's not looking at me so I'll get her to look at me hopefully yeah that's the best I can do she is one of the most popular I'll show you guys my um, map and stuff afterwards oh here's Pietro just tearing up and as you can see in the background that is my island flag oh I just saw um, Judy move so this is Judy um, she is a snooty character, I think. So, obviously, we do have some stuff here that's not pretty. Since I haven't really worked on this area that much. So, yeah. Uh, this be my house. Uh, I haven't decorated it at all inside. So, we're not going in there. Um, here is uh, Marina. Yeah, um, that's why... I said I time travel because in game yesterday was my birthday in real life it's not yet so then uh, we do have this is Marina's house um, I'm planning of getting rid of her soon so that's why she doesn't have her own plate here but then this is Marshall he's very sweet he's a squirrel so let's go say hi to him he is in his house so this is little Marshall, he's very cute, very very cute, hey Marshall, mm -hmm. yeah so he also be a smug um, villager so basically his whole house is kind of like a coffee shop, uh, very nice, I do like how they decorate their homes, I wish I could say the same for me, so let's go on. I mean, this is just the beach. I did nothing yet um, for this. But then we do have more houses here. So this is Julian's. And this is Lucky's house. Uh, he is a mummy um, doggo. I uh, haven't seen him around. Oh, there he is. So here you can see Judy uh, up close. So this be uh, Lucky. And he's starting to fish. Okay. So, um, before we go into the next area, I want to show you guys how my 
um, museum looks like. So this is the bridge that goes to the museum. So let's go here and look up. Uh, it's still a work in progress, of course. Um, there's some stuff I do need. So we got our benches here. You here you can have your drinks and your snacks. There's a popcorn machine up there. Then if you do need to phone anyone, you can have this. This is a small boutique where you can get some souvenirs. And then if you go here and look up, you can see the museum a bit better. So this is a statue I've placed outside. Uh, I still need more relics here and wanting to finish the T-Rex over there. Um, so then we do run this side and these are some artifacts that you can see. But then, please note this isn't for sensitive eyes. We've got this guy. Um, yeah. So I don't know if I must blur the, this out or not, but okay. So here's your anatomical um, character or model. Yeah, that's gonna be blurred out. Um, we got a little dinosaur standee here. And if you're tired, you can just sit in here. So I'll quickly run through my museum since I do be having a completed museum. Okay, so we are inside the museum now. So let's quickly run through the bug exhibit. I'm not gonna do this uh, in depth because I hate bugs. So let's just run through. I'm just gonna run through. I'm not gonna tell you everything. But this is my villager Audi. She is very nice. Uh, she's looking at the butterflies. So there's a spider up there. I don't want to go near that thing. Different butterflies and stuff. Um, here's some beetles. There's a bug. We go down here. Here's some more bugs. And some fishies. Okay, so let's go to this next area. These are all butterflies, which is really good. There is a frog. Um, this is by far the best um, area in the museum for bugs. So here's all different types of bugs you can see. Uh, staying away from these because I don't like them. So these are wolf roaches, I believe, and cardo shell, and crickets, and mole crickets. Up there you get more um, but a butterfly, maybe these are fleas, these are mosquitoes, and these are flies. So I'm not gonna take too much time here. Do you not like them at all? I think this might have been everything in the um, insect area, so I'm gonna get out of here. Don't like it at all, not at all. Okay, so let's go to the right here to the fish area. Uh, that's at least a bit better because it's really nice how the aquarium area is. So I think let's start back here. So these are fishes. Some of them are really nice, um, very nice. Then there's another frog, there's a turtle, sturgeon, and there's a uh, crab or something down there, or uh, a crawfish or whatever. Here's a turtle up here. These are bigger fishes, so very nice. I don't. Okay, now let's do these first. I think these are all different trouts. Um, normal fishes and then mouth water fishes. Um, so these basically represent where at the stage of a river you can find them. Um, which is really nice to see how they did some of those small details though. Um, so these are your ocean fishes just look at this crab look at this crab just vibing just vibing 
let's just do that that's an there is an octopi this is crab and a mantine or manta ray there's an eel in the back and a hammerhead shark which is awesome so if you look here you're standing on top of jellyfish and these are little creatures though um, very cute so these are angel fish I think or butterfly fish something like that so here you find different fish as well I've just saw Dory down there uh, ugly fish this I think this is a mahi mahi or something more uh, crawfish uh, there's a slug or something um, so yeah oh wait there's Nemo Nemo okay so let's go to this side um, see the bigger thingies it's a really nice aquarium I'm not gonna lie I really do like how this aquarium looks okay I think these are for the big boys as you can see so the, this is a really nice area so you can see the whale shark the normal shark swordfish this might be the mai mai though uh, and then all these smaller fish very good this is the tuna uh, it's a really nice but this this fish is huge uh, it reminds me of sharpedo Let's go down to these creepy creatures. I don't think they really do get light. So one of them do be representing Relicum from um, Pokemon as well. Same fish. Uh, I think these things are those that don't get much light or anything. Uh, since this is a football, aka soccer fish. This is a massive crab. I think this is a spider crab. So, I um, don't know if there's anything up here though. Oh yeah, you just walk past here so you can see better. See? And then I think that it might be all for the aquarium. Let's just see that. Yeah, uh, this is everything from the aquarium. So I'm gonna go on top here again so here you walk on top of most of the things um, down here so let's go to maybe the fossil area next okay so let's go down here to the fossil area and let's see all the dinosaurs so these be small fossils and stuff um, uh, some of them, these are just replicas. I don't know what they're supposed to be, but it looks like a statue of a tarantula and such. So let's go on this side. So these are all the dinosaurs. Uh, this is a pterodactyl. And then these are all other dinosaurs. There is a T-Rex, I think. Um, these are more, so you can just see how they look. It's a very long one though. Uh, and if you stand here, you see the comet that killed the dinosaurs. Great that they added that with it. So this is my old dinosaur and this represents the comet that hit the earth. So let's go up here. So here's the T-Rex again. So this side I think these are the mammals and stuff um, not dinosaur related but obviously like the saber tooth the uh, woolly mammoth everything still don't know what this thing is and there is a human skull and if you stand here and you see all these they represent the villagers of this um, game and then of course if you stand here it lights up and that represents you uh, I think that's basically all for the fossil area. Um, yeah, it's just basically bones, of course. And then the last area in the museum will be the art gallery. Um, 
so I'll be we'll be heading that way now okay so now if we go up here it is the art gallery let's go see some art okay so these are statues um, all these are genuine stuff so of course we've got this thing yeah and then we got some familiar paintings you guys would be familiar with here's another statue here's some art there's that head more art down here uh, it's different arts uh, obviously starry starry night uh, I think this is a thinker weird stuff here I think these are mainly Japanese artifacts and stuff uh, here are the terracotta army um, so let's go this side and up here some more um, paintings huge ones though so yeah that is basically the um, museum nothing too out of the ordinary oh yeah some more statues so um let me go show you guys the last area of my island okay so let's head down here to uh the eastern part of my island where we will see the season of autumn or fall as most people call it so that is of course mushroom season and we've got some pumpkins got different flowers mushrooms please just ex excuse my doggo that is barking so these are fall and mushrooms and everything uh, these are our last two characters homes this one is Anka she is a, an Egyptian mummy or Egyptian cat uh, this is Sherp he is a goat um, so then instead of running around I will be taking a shortcut up here so here's more um, mushroom stuff and then this is a moon pool and the shape of a crescent moon of course then here are some more mushroom stuff let's go to the other side to get around there uh, as you can see on my map on the right that's how the island mainly looks so um then we go up here this is my campsite where our visitors come and stay so then um i'm also going to show you guys something uh please do not do this at home um it can be quite dangerous so you guys know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna jump in and just swim a bit around so um, this is basically a new feature they added is of course your swimming and then obviously uh, catching some sea creatures so now I just need to get to the beach to be able to climb out since you can't climb out from um, rocks I haven't done anything with my secret beach so I'm not gonna show you guys that um, but that's basically the main points of my island uh, then let's go to um, the entrance where I will show you guys um, my characters and stuff so oh, I see I do be having a present let's shoot this thing down don't think it will have a DIY in it see what my present is um, present five iron nuggets so yeah guys my island is five star uh, as you can see I do have lily of the valleys okay let's just stand here so this is town hall and this is where I will be finishing this um, little mini tour um, so yeah then this is how town hall looks and there's my little um flower or oh, um flag not flower no pietro you're not gonna leave you're not leaving oh you're giving me something thank you uh, i better not though 
so yeah let me show you guys my um, island map so these are my villages this is Audi, Julian, Lucky, uh, Marina, Anka, um, Judy, Marshall, Chirp, Dom and Pietro and this is me so yeah I do got most popular characters I'm just in need of Raymond though and um, that's why I'm gonna get rid of Marina sometime and try to get uh, Raymond in there so yeah that is basically my island so guys I do hope you guys enjoyed this um, if you want to see more about this island you can enter this dream code to come and visit me and guys I do hope you enjoyed this video so if you did please consider liking subscribing and commenting what was your favorite part of this video so uh, if you would also like to see more of these um, videos leave a comment at the moment I am waiting for uh, the fall update so I haven't really touched my island in weeks so yeah guys I will be seeing you guys on the next one remember everyone stay safe and ciao